News 4 Jax and Consumer Reports, working together to save your family money. If you have your heart set on buying a new car this year, as we explained yesterday here on The Morning Show, you need to be prepared to pay significantly more because there's a shortage of parts. But if you are buying, consumer investigator Lauren Verno says there are some steps that you could take to try for the best possible deal. Some vehicles are so hard to come by that consumers are paying well above sticker price. Consumer Reports has seen the Jeep Compass selling for 15% over MSRP. The Chevrolet Silverado 2500, 17%. And the 2021 Kia Telluride is currently selling for 18% over. Consumer Reports says your best bet is to choose a model that isn't in such high demand. And when you are ready to go head to head with a salesperson at the dealership, be prepared to negotiate. Let the salesperson know that you've researched the transaction price for the car and trim level that you want. This means you know approximately what the dealer paid for it, and you've already calculated what you are prepared to pay. If the salesperson can meet your target price, let them know you'll be ready to buy immediately. And if not, you intend to visit other dealerships. The salesperson will try to keep the focus on your monthly payment. Insist on negotiating on one thing at a time. Lock in the price of your new car first. Then you can begin discussing a trade-in or financing. Speaking of trade-ins, since the used car market is also tight, your older car will probably never be worth more than it is right now. There's no reason a dealership shouldn't give you at least its wholesale value as a trade-in allowance. But if you are offered a price that's in your target range, Consumer Report says you should probably accept it because supplies continue to be low and you might not find the car or a better deal at another dealership. Lauren Verno, Channel 4, the local station. And that's an important point. So Consumer Reports says if the traded discussions become just too burdensome, you can always sell the car elsewhere. You know, it's CarMax, online retailers like uh, Carvana and Tread. Now find out what your trade-in is worth. We have a direct link on our website to plugging your make, your model, and the year. You can also check out Lauren's story from yesterday where she had great information about how to buy a used car without getting a lemon. Just go to newsforjax.com slash consumer reports.